Fortunately, I don't have video of this car, only some pictures. These were taken, I think, somewhere around 2004. And this was a Superbird that was local to us. Um, original owner. It had been parked in an old service station. Um, these pictures are taken just through the window beside the service station. Um, but it was sitting in there. This was the side, the wing. Um, couldn't get very good pictures of it. I didn't have access to actually get into the building, although I, I knew of the owner. Um, I just, I didn't, at the time I knew it wasn't for sale or anything. It wasn't any need to bother him to try to get too close to it, check it out. But the good part about this car is they ended up, I was through the front of the service station trying to look at the, the front of the car. They had the hood up, but couldn't really see anything. Um, the good thing about this car was they eventually did get it out. Uh, left it original. I think the motor was rebuilt and some wiring work done. Um, that was what I was told when it was still in the service station was the wiring. I gotten some mice in the car and chewed up the wiring and all and he either had the motor just freshened up or rebuilt when they pulled the car out I'm not sure they actually drove it to the show um, 2006 or so I think but I think they left everything else original probably just new tires the engine freshening up not sure what they did to the drivetrain but um, the car was pulled out and fixed and as far as I know the original owner still has the car I'm just not sure where it's at these days like I say I apologize for not having a video in 2004 I don't think no, I probably had a camera that did video but it wouldn't have done very good and with us not being able to actually get to the car with it sitting in the service station video wouldn't have been much good but it's pretty cool to actually a car like this that was sitting one of those I'm gonna fix it up one day type things I don't want to sell it and I know he had some pretty good offers on the car from the people that knew that it was sitting there um, but he never did sell it he eventually did pull it out get it on the road um, not sure where the car is at now as far as you know if he still has it or if a family member one of his kids might have it these days I'm not sure but pretty neat one of the old I'm gonna fix it up one day and I like it just the way it is with the patina and everything that's all I would have done to it leave the original paint and all on it and drive and enjoy it um, the car wasn't really that rusty because as far as I know it was pretty much always kept inside so yeah there it is something you don't see every day of Plymouth Superbird and one that actually is uh, picked out at least it wasn't left sitting in the yard I mean it was in a shop so it stayed pretty dry just got some mice in it uh, I'll be adding a few more little short videos of some other stuff that I've found some that I've brought home and some that I haven't that I just knew about um, like and subscribe if you'd like to see some more I'll be posting more car stuff in the future also